All right, I'm out here today at the infantry camp. Of course, uh, this is my first day off to metal detecting in probably 18. I worked uh, 18 days straight, 12 hour days. I was ready for a day off, but anyway, uh, it was cooler last week, but uh, unfortunately I was at, a, at work, so. And I got out here today and it's uh, probably about 95. It feels like it anyway. The humidity's probably around 80%, maybe 75, 80%, but I know it's hot. But I just now, I've been fooling around here in the uh, field just a little bit. I drove my truck all the way back here today uh, where I could get to the air in case I needed it. So, and then I've got a few Gatorades sitting around for uh, something to drink. But anyway, that's gonna, either way, it's gonna be hopefully a pretty good day. I know it's hot, but. I'd rather be here as I had work anyway. So. But anyway, I'll get off here and uh, hopefully I'll be back with something uh, good. All right, uh, I'm back. I've got a good uh, signal. It's uh, ringing up high 50s, low 60s. There was a 70. See what we got here. Yeah, good gracious. <laughs> That's like a rock. I know we've had a lot of rain this summer, but as you can tell, it doesn't take it long to dry out. Let me. Uh, Yep, it's like concrete. So it's about two inches deep. Yeah, where are these cows standing here? When it after it rains, they've got it packed down pretty hard. So. Gracious. It better be something good. Well, I hope it is. That's out, whatever it is. Ah, right there it is. Get out here. It's a bullet. It's a 
I believe it's card bullet. Let me try to clean it up here a little bit. Looks like a 54 caliber. It's been carved on a little bit, so I have to get home and run some. I may have been shot. Uh, no. It's been carved on. I guess it may have been pulled, then carved on. You can see the tip of it's messed up a little bit there. And you can tell, I don't know if you can tell how the angle is. It's been carved on, so. Anyway, that's another good find. Yeah. I'll get off here and hopefully I'll be back with some more. All right, uh, still here digging at this infantry camp. Uh, I made it to the woods a little bit and I've seen this tree right here and it's getting ready to fall down. Well, it's probably going to split and I thought, well, I'll get up under where the limb's going to fall before it does fall and won't be able to detect it. But I've got a good signal. It was ringing up uh, mid 70, mid to high 70s, just as clear. And uh, of course, it's a pretty good find. It goes to uh, maybe a banjo or something. It's the tensioners on the, uh, I guess it's for the tensioners for the string. That's what I was thinking it may be. I'll have to get it home and clean it up some more and just double check. I don't see any writing on it or anything yet, but it's still dirty. So, I don't know if it's plastic or what. Oh, just, I don't know if it's period, but uh, it is amongst all the rest of the stuff, and I have found several harmonica reeds in here. Uh, actually, where I'm at, I found the harmonica that was uh, still had wood to it. Well, wood with it. So Anyway, I'll get off here, and hopefully I'll be back with some more goodies. All right, I'm still up uh, around this tree. I've come to the other side now. I've dug a few shotgun shells, but I don't know what this is. Got it out of the hole. Maybe a flat button. Oh, that's a... That's a uh, O'Brien brother. Duckhead button. Make up the duckhead there. I don't know if they zoom in or not. Yeah, that's what it is. All right, I'll get off here. All right, I'm still out here. It's getting real hot, but right now it's a uh, it is uh, clouding up a little bit, kind of covering the sun. Thought I heard it thunder in the background a little bit. But anyway, I've got a had a decent signal. But uh, anyway, I got it out. Uh, it's a three ring. It's kind of funny end. I don't know if it's been carved or what. Looks like, yeah, it looks like it's been carved. So, that is a good find. Kind of got a funny base on it. I'll have to get the home cleaned it up. Anyway, I'll get off here and hopefully I'll be back with something. Alright, uh, I'm back with today's find. I had a decent day, I guess. It was pretty warm outside, but uh, after I started finding the bullets and stuff, it kind of cooled off, and uh, I think I could hear the thunder in the background. But anyway, I uh, ended up a uh, piece of brass here. I don't really don't know what it is. Uh, it doesn't have any writing on it. It's kind of neat. Found this piece. Uh, I don't know if it goes to a guitar or a banjo or something. Uh, I, I don't even know if it's period or not. It's uh, looks like the adjusters for the uh, strings on the instrument. I don't know if. Like I said, I don't know if it's a guitar or banjo. Anyway, it was kind of neat. I was trying to find some writing on it. But anyway, um, found uh, found this little aluminum button. That was kind of neat. Uh, found, of course, found this. Uh, it was old Brian Brothers duck head button. I don't know if it was zoom in there or not. Uh, you 
can see the duck head just a little bit there. Uh, end up finding this card piece of uh, three ring. The soldier carved it off. Just threw it down or something. But that was kind of neat. Found this little piece of bucking ball. And uh, found this piece of flat lead. I really don't know what it is. Doesn't look like it's got teeth marks in it. Looks like it's been hammered out though. I don't know. Maybe a poker chip or something. And uh, found this little uh, underwear button. Of course, it's corroded pretty bad. Um, see a couple pieces of camp lead there. Found these uh, bullets. that has been carved on. The end of it, I don't know if it's been pulled or what. It, the end of it's pretty messed up. But look, it hadn't been shot. So, you can tell where they've carved on it a little bit. Carved the rings off. Carved on the base a little bit. And then found this other bullet. Probably 58 caliber. And of course, they carved on it quite a bit. Or they pulled it one. I don't know. That's kind of, I've never found one that's got the. Uh, point on it like that so you can uh, maybe they pulled it uh, I'm really not for sure but the base of it's kinda funny on it it's uh, kinda smooth shape instead of the sharp it's kinda bent over on the edges so if anybody's got any clues on that or any ideas I believe the Tennessee Trio I think they found one out there like that and I don't know what they ever found out about it so and then uh, them two J hooks, I found them uh, probably a couple weeks ago out there. And I don't think I got got them on video, but anyway, uh, I found about the same place I found the bullets at. But anyway, well, that was uh, today's finds, and uh, thanks for watching. Happy hunting.